Hello there, my name is Ben Marks from Venture Caravans and today I'm going to be showing you around the new 2018 Eldest San Remo 304. So the San Remo range is exclusive to Venture Caravans and motorhomes. It's based upon the standard Explore range but it features a whole host of additional upgrades and features. The San Remo 304 in particular is a four berth, lightweight, compact caravan. It features an L-shaped front seating area, rear dinette and then a drop down bunk bed as well. So on the exterior, the most noticeable feature is the bespoke graphics on the side, so they look nice and modern. And you've got hints of silver, red and burgundy in there too. And they really help to fill out the side of the caravan. The silver of the graphics also match nicely with the silver side skirts and spats, which again are exclusive to the Sunnery Mo range. For 2018, we've also added this large front graphic up there, which helps to keep the modern caravan looking nice and modern. But the most dramatic change to the San Remo is the solid GRP sides, and these replace the standard aluminium sides found on the Explore. So the GRP sides are nice and strong, dent resistant. So any awning poles or bike handles, if they come in contact with the GRP sides, you won't get any dents, the GRP will just repel them. Whereas on a traditional aluminium sided caravan, you'll get your small dents on the side. So we're standing on the San Remo, we also fit the SE pack. So this includes your Alco AKS 3004 hitch stabiliser, your spare wheel which is located underneath in a carrier, your alloy wheels with wheel lock receptor and then also your CD radio too. So as you look towards the front of the caravan you've got a full width gas locker. So this has got two locking points, one on either side so it's nice and secure. And inside you've got space for two gas bottles and then plenty of room either side for your accessories. On the outside for 2018 we've also included a gas barbecue point. Just right near the front so you can be barbecuing outside of your awning. And then we've also fitted the 230 volt socket down there which is located right in the middle of your awning so if you want a fridge or a TV for example outside it's a great place for it. So let's look towards the back. Again the San Remo and Venture branding continue. Now. You can see it's a very nice looking caravan. And then we'll head in to the inside to show you the other features in there. The most noticeable thing as soon as you walk in is the Venture branded doormat and also the Taylor made loose fit carpets that replace the carpet runners found in the Explore range. So opposite the door we've got the side dinette and bunk bed. The front L shaped lounge then also the kitchen area at the front there. So on the kitchen we've got the dual fuel hob. So this replaces the three gas burners found on the Explore Caravan and adds the electric hot plate at the back there for when you're connected to your mains electric. Next to that we've got your sink unit with a domestic style tap. And you'll notice that both the hob and the sink have glass lids and that helps to expend, uh, extend your worktop space when you're not using one of them. But then we've also fitted a lift up flap here which is right next to two main sockets there so that's probably where you're going to put your toaster or kettle for example. You've also got a oven and grill combined appliance there. And then we've also got the microwave which is a standard specification item on the San Remo again. Storage options in the kitchen. Got a storage place there for your mugs and plates. And you've also got three pull out drawers in the kitchen area. And then two larger cupboards. So one down there, and then one under the oven. Opposite the kitchen, then you've got the fridge. which has got your internal freezer box there as well. 
So looking towards the front of the San Remo, you'll notice that the upholstery has changed. So this upholstery is taken from the Eldis Encore motor range. And you've got some nice burgundy touches which complement the exterior graphics. And you'll also notice the bolster cushions and the curtains as well, featuring the same colour. So for sleeping, this makes into a double bed. And you've got a large pull-up flap there, which is located right next to your TV connection points, just there. Above the fridge, you've got a large wardrobe. And that's where your freestanding table also hangs. Just in there. So I'm sure you're looking towards the back of the caravan. Just show you the bathroom. So you've got a nice, elegant wash basin with domestic style taps. Got a mirror. Another hanging rail, so if you've got wet clothes, coats for example, storage cupboard and then your cassette toilet down the bottom there. So another feature is the upgraded Hecky roof lights. So a lot bigger than the standard Explore range so that helps to make it nice light and airy on the inside. So looking towards the dinette, so great for the kids, or if you're a couple, a nice place to sit. But then for night, for sleeping, this also makes a single bed. And above, you've got your bunk bed. So on either side, you've got a securing bolt. So if you undo the bolt, the bed then drops down. And then, on top of the bunk bed, you've got a bunk guard protector just in there with your mattress on top then when you're done with it it just pushes up out the way and you can still leave your mattress on the top there and you haven't got to worry about storing that in any exterior lockers or under the bed for example so thank you very much for watching I'll see you soon cheers